Thursday's action at the Rottenbaum Tennis Arena in Hamburg saw the remaining second round matches of the German Open completed. And in a tournament filled with surprises, there was another opportunity for some of the unsung members of the ATP World Tour to come to the fore. Slovenian Gregor Zemia recorded his first victory on the main tour in over three years in the first round. Next up was a tough test in the shape of the number eight seed, Guillermo Garcia Lopez. Zemia lost nearly all of the 2014 season to injury, and the football world number 43 is showing a welcome return to full health. But Garcia Lopez was relentless in the opening set. Finally. The pair had met once previously, with Garcia Lopez victorious in three sets back in 2013. But the Spaniard never looked like being pushed that hard here as he continued his fine play in the second set. And the Spanish star completed a comprehensive straight sets win. The eighth seed into the last eight. Really professional performance from the world number 56, Guillermo Garcia Lopez. Louis Vessels is Germany's top-ranked junior and one of only two surviving home players in the draw. The youngster faced off against Slovakian number seven seed, Martin Klijan. The match proved to be a real case of men against boys, as 17-year-old Vessels struggled to come to terms with Klijan's fearsome forehand. Wow, take that. That's really rubbing it in. The first set in the bag in just 22 minutes, Klijan continued his ruthless march through the match. Well, it was great depth from Vessels, but when you've got the power that Klijan possesses, you can turn a point in your favour so quickly. A good experience for the teenager, but Klijan far too good on the day as he raced into the last eight. Oh, it's in. Martin Klijan, winner in Rotterdam, has his eyes on a second ATP World Tour 500 title in 2016. He's through to the quarterfinals and who knows how much further he may go. The last match of the day saw Daniel Jimeno Trevere, the conqueror of the number two seed Benoit Paire, battle it out with Russia's Daniel Medvedev for a place in the quarterfinals. It was the second time the pair had met this year, with Medvedev the victory in Bordeaux, and in the opener here in Hamburg, he again appeared to have the edge. Big. 20 year old Medvedev is up to a career high ranking, but in the second set tie break, Jimeno Trevere was using all his experience to take the match the distance. And there it is, inside in again. With the first two sets taking over two hours, the attritional nature of the match continued into the deciding set. And with both players suffering from the physical demands, it was Jimeno Trevere who eventually was able to get over the line. An absolute epic Daniel Jimeno Trevere of Spain. He's come through somehow, some way. But my goodness, did he have to work for it. And I'm sure the respect is mutual and absolute between these two gladiators. What a fight they've put on. So with the quarter-final lineup now complete, there was a tremendously varied mix of players left standing in the 2016 German Open. Two ATP World Tour 500 winners from this year, the top seed and last remaining German in the draw, and also those players still looking to make a real impact this season.